Well, well, well. What a nice surprise to wake up to at 7 a.m. this morning. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome you faces to a new dawn and a new day where we have got a day of travelling ahead of us. Five and a half hours of said travelling. And inside this package, I have something new from Syndicate Original to keep me warm the entire way there. Now, I know you've seen this design before. It's the Venture. Venture design looking all beautiful with the print on the sleeves, the chest and the back but as you notice there's a hood on it everyone was asking we do a hoodie version so you know what we did exactly just that all right i look like an absolute insane person but great success the boots have been found therefore hopefully the rest of this journey i am not going to be crying that i am freezing cold oh, oh, oh. yes i was actually going to go wearing uh jordan ones uh, which is not a good idea, but it's all I had is the closest to a boot. And I can't really tell you that these boots are the most snowproof boots, but something is afoot. Ah, uh, yes, typical of me leaving it to the last minute. Uh, my flight board's at 9.30, it's 8.48, and I'm in standstill traffic. Oh, yeah. Hey, up, hold that thought. It seems like we're cooking with gas. 8.57, fingers crossed. I'm saying this right now. That taxi driver from Tameside Taxis, what, what a man. He flew here, doing the speed limit the entire way, but his driving was impeccable. All right, here we are. Where is thin air? Now, I'm not trying to say I'm a mastermind of traveling, but I got through security pretty goddamn fast. And uh, now I'm chilling, so I'm gonna go get a Starbucks, go to my gate, chill and then i'm set i've got my ipad loaded up with the crown so i'm going to watch that and uh we're rocking and rolling no panic whatsoever i just got like loads of euros out but i don't even know if finland takes euros bollocks <laughs> oh yeah right got my coffee vanilla latte as always from the books of star and as far as i'm aware Helsinki gate 22 that is not my final destination so away we go okay I just did that tune sorry can I just express how hot I am with the fact that I'm wearing a long sleeve t-shirt a long, a long sleeve top the hoodie and then this coat I don't drink in a coffee I'm hot I hope it's Gary, it's Gary the pilot, and Steve, Gary and Steve. I'm trying to cane this coffee before I get on the plane. And it's just heating me up even more. <sighs> All right, it's go time. One small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. So I'm sat here looking at my chair and I'm like, device holder must be stowed for taxi jeering and uh, okay. I'm like, what? What's a, what's a device holder? Oh my God. Oh my God. Genius. Oh my God, it gets better. Okay, bye bye. Genius. I'm gonna teach you an airplane trick which you may not know. Most people think that the outside at the back of it or just underneath it like at the back it's a little lever and if you pull it ta -da! oh she's sleeping sorry yeah a little secret trick if you want a bit more room there you go tips with time travel Finland welcome to Helsinki where we fly with Finnish Airlines the Airlines of Finland oh yes next up I've got a two hour flight all the way to Gilda or Gidla, which I tell you what, this is seriously reminding me of Iceland's airport. I'm just trying to make sure I'm not actually in Iceland right now. Is this Reykjavik? I am in Reykjavik right now, or not. Definitely Finland. <laughs> no, I needed any more proof I was in the right place. Oh, there you go. I'm feeling like I may have over prepared looking at this guy. Flippy floppies. 
All right, I'm pretty sure that that 421 there to Kittler is me. So where am I going? 31E. Oh yes, just what I've come to Finland for. The Sausage Co. <laughs> if I didn't have to like head over to my gate area, I'd be very... T oh, it's okay. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Okay. She didn't see me. Okay. She didn't see me there. <laughs> just walked straight into me. Um, I would be messing with that place. Well, that's like a, a modern yo sushi. Everything I'm learning here is everywhere you go, you can just buy fur. Special offers on... <gasps> Wait, it's actually reindeer hide. What? Oh no! I'm gonna go and see some reindeers. And there's one here dead. Oh god, rip. I like how that's like a fine food place to actually buy like snacks from for your journey. And it's like, once you're here, buy reindeer skin. Thank you. Dream it, live it, make it your choice today. Wow. I have an hour between my flight, so I've come to raid the fridges or cupboards of whatever they've got. Oh yes, exactly whatever was needed. A wooden telephone, bottle opener. Oh my God. <laughs> I had no idea that's what it was, but I love it. But for 11 euros, I'm right, thanks. What is that? It is a wooden platter with wooden knife. I like it. All right, what do we got? Um, <laughs> we got Jaffa, which is some fizzy orange. Novelli, which mango and guava. What else we got? We got some zoo up orange juice, some sausages in a packet, some not quite sure what that is. Oh wait, oh my god, it rained here. Ah uh, yes, a, a Nordic nibel, smoked salmon. Oh my god, that looks pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. And then you got some salmon roe in absolute mad quantities up here. I kinda want some. What in God's earth is this? 2024? rye crust fish pie mm. no i'm okay thanks what is this rye crust pork pie mm. i'm okay thanks Ooh, no, no, no thanks you see honey i can mess with dried what is that dried what oh are they mushrooms i was gonna say they might be mushrooms but i could be wrong that i can mess with this i can mess with this is all okay now the random pots of stuff, not so much, but look at this cheese. Oh, I love me some cheese. Salmon jerky, but it's Scottish, but I want it. I'm gonna get it. Oh my God. <laughs> Reindeer chips, oh my God. <laughs> That's just brutal. I'm getting it. All right, this I can kind of relate to, some sweets, but it's um, it's chalk. Oh, Moomin, I recognise that. Isn't this chalk? I think that's what we call it in the UK. What, what, no, rock. <laughs> chalk. <laughs> rock. I'm going to go for a taste test of a reindeer chip. Very soft. Not as like, hard like jerky I thought it was going to be. Very fatty, very like buttery, and soft. Not too salty, you know. I kind of describe it as an in between between parma ham and bacon with half the salt. Okay, this next one, the, the salmon jerky, must be really smelly on your fingers because it comes with tweezers. My only way to describe it. Oh my god. Look at the size of that. Only way to describe that, even though it's Scottish, not even. <laughs> no, are you, Duke? Oh, no, not Nordish. Dusty. I did it. I found him. I found no Egypt Santa. <laughs> oh my god, right. <coughs> Gates boarding. Time to go. And go. I can't say it seems like the most efficient way of charging uh, your phone from the ceiling, but um, yeah, okay, I guess it works. All right, time for bus number two. And step two of the flight commences now. So the like air temperature minus six. <laughs> oh my God, das es kalt. This is the first time I can ever say I've walked along off an airplane and it's been icy snow. But, oh, here we go. Welcome to lap one, therefore. <laughs> I could never say I've landed on snow before in my life. But 
It is snowy. I come to that one. <laughs> it is not every day you walk straight outside and the taxi you're about to jump into is covered in snow. <laughs> Mate, this ride is pimping. I like it a lot. Bro, even the petrol station's covered in snow. Oh, there's a snow plow. <laughs> Mate, I feel like such a tourist right now, but this is the best. Look at him go! Whoa, I can't believe I just started filming out this window at the same time. Go on, the lad! Yeah! Mr. McSnowplow face! Okay, I might have my first hiccup of the trip. I just went to go on my phone to remote access my computer back, at, back, back in my office so I could upload the vlog that Orion's edited and uploaded to Dropbox. Um, as I've gone to it, it says my computer's offline, so I think that um, Mark from the bedroom company may have tripped the power again or turned it off and it's reset my computer, like turned my computer off. So I've got to try and find out if he has done, if he's left, and if I can get someone to go around to my house to turn my computer on. Ah, after a great stamp. If, if I can't sort it, then I did say I'll film, vlog, all that sort of stuff, and then when I get back, I'll put together a video, but it is what it is. You could have all the money in the world, but I don't think you could pay me to drive down this road. Mate, that is my worst fear, driving on black ice and just cruising away. <laughs> Terrifying. Oh, it's so magical. Oh, whoa, there's like shops and stuff. And a digital billboard, you know, for your convenience of sales. But look at that, a Christmas tree in the roundabout. Ah. Oh. That is one hell of a pretty sight to jump out of a taxi to. <laughs> so I checked in. Oh my God, they're everywhere. My little favorite little snowman thing. Not, um, it, gnome things, not snowman. Fireplace roaring, looking amazing. They're giving me a map of where to walk to my cabin. Number 38, let's go. Okay, this is looking pretty damn cool. Literally. <laughs> All right. Home, sweet home. Oh, now this is good. Okay, obviously there's snow just chilling on the glass, but I'm assuming the heat will go down in it. Nice little sofa. You can book all the excursions of going seeing Santa and all that sort of stuff on the iPad. Again, beautiful comfy bed underneath it. Then inside, wow, this is a nice ass bathroom. Shower, toilet, sink, me. Oh, and it's time for some food at the Northern Light Village. Uh, throwing this out here right now, there's reindeers on everything. But do you know where there's also reindeers? In the menus, on everything. I'm not eating reindeer, I'm having pork. Pork belly or something like that. But I'm trying to pick what adventures I'm going on whilst I'm here. I think I'm definitely going to go snowmobiling. I don't really care about ice fishing. I could go and see Santa. <laughs> cross-country skiing lesson that sounds pretty cool photography workshop nah. aurora hunting by snowmobile yes and then i think that is that well there's actually one way you can go out and uh aurora expedition on snowshoes includes an evening snack by a campfire that you set up right i love it i'm well excited <laughs> So I've already ordered over there, but I didn't know that I'm half bored. So I get like part of my dinner and stuff included. I'm not quite sure what that is, but we've got some salmon and some tiny little fish in between it. Looking quite fishy. Nope. I wasn't joking about the, the reindeers on it. Reindeers on it. <laughs> reindeers on it. And then you can eat reindeers. Even more reindeers. Just seems a little bit harsh to be honest. Oh look, dead reindeers. I think I've gone for a sort of boar and mushroom soup by the looks of things, and it looks quite tasty. Wild mushroom and boar soup. Mm -hmm. Not bad. And for my main course, I have gone for the pork belly. Mm -hmm. Damn, this is looking good. Pork belly taste test. Oh, very sweet. Mm. Not bad. Now I'm not being rude, but why is his hat so big? I have questions. 
sat in front of the fire with a hot chocolate. I return after leaving the fireplace on and oh, the windows have melted. So I know you guys won't really be able to see anything, but like that's the cabin I'm in and right behind it is the Northern Lights. Now to my actual naked eye, I can legitimately see green, but because you can't see it, I'll put up the photo of the overexposed image I just took. Now, look at that. How crazy is that? Ooh. Ladies and gentlemen, I am absolutely exhausted doing this outro for you. You'll see what I did tomorrow, pretty much on my Instagram. If you if you don't follow me on Instagram, at syndicate here, um, you are missing out on the behind the scenes of what I get up to out and about. But man, that was that, it's been a really fun day. But I just got back from a pretty grueling three hour like sort of adventure, and I am one tired man. So I'm gonna get all cosy in front of this fire and probably fall asleep and get a whiskey or something like that to try and warm my stomach but guys thank you for watching i hope you're enjoying the journey like i said there may or may not be a vlog tomorrow um i'm only here for like two days anyway so it might just be a case of enjoying where i am switching off and just uh you know enjoying the christmas vibe but until then you'll find out whether or not there is tomorrow or not in tomorrow's vlog if there is one so if you guys want to cop yourself the brand new venture hoodie make sure you do so link is down in the description go buy yourself one in time for christmas it has kept me so warm seriously i'm not just saying that like so warm this entire journey this since i've been here in uh, in finland I'm, i think i'm in the i'm officially in lapland which is pretty cool but uh, yeah, I'm gonna go guys. So thank you very much for watching. Make sure you leave a like, like leave a like, rain, subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow at 7 p.m. for the next day of vlog. Silence.